Hello YouTube, um, today I've been getting a lot of comments about how people couldn't read my text um, in my MC Law Creative Server video, a tutorial on how to do that, so i uh, put all the links in the description below, um, but you want to go to mysql.com, hit downloads, MySQL Community Server, select your platform and then choose your installer no thanks just take me to the downloads HTTP not that install we'll run it alright we want to hit next accept the terms next just typical install um, I don't know why I have an application running but um okay well that error thing shouldn't pop up for you guys but so we want to just go through all this then this will pop up so next through it and launch the MySQL instance configuration wizard finish and then this will pop up and then hit next reconfigure detailed developer multifunctional database Just basically keep it all the same keep it all the same um, you can include the bin for this video just do it um, Current root password, we're just going to make it plain and simple. We're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You shouldn't, uh, you should only have two, but I already have my SQL, so it's given me this current root, so we'll just get these two. Um, don't select anything else than this. Um, next, then hit execute and it will begin okay so while that's going um, so configuration file created service restarted successfully security settings applied Please finish to close the wizard. Finish. Okay. So now my SQL is all set up. Practically. Um, so we can go into our MC Law application. I'll provide a you know, link below. And it'll give us an error. It says they have not been set. The settings have not been set. So we close out of that. We want to go to our properties folder. Server. I want to make this make this full screen for you. We want to scroll down and right where it says here. It says my SQL information. So you want to keep all this the same except for right here. Right where it says password, we want to change this to what we said our password is. One, two, three, four, five. So now we can save this. And we'll be okay with that. Alright, so now um, if you go into your start and type run, um, it will give you an option like this. Once you click on it, um, it's not showing up in mine. But um, you want to type cmd, and this will bring up a command prompt. And right in this, you want to type ip config. And it will give you all this. You know, scroll up, and what you need is your default gateway. So, mine is 192.168.1.1. So, we're going to type that in 192.168.1.1. And it'll give you an authentication required. So, for this, um, I'll post it in the description below. Make sure to read that. 
because otherwise you are not going this isn't going to work oh yeah so now that you've logged in you go to applications and gaming I have uh, Lynx's router and um, what we want to do is we're going to have set up two so we want to make one for Minecraft and this is from 25565 to 25565 and then once we go into here um, my IPv4 address is 192.168.1.106 we want to take that, the last three digits, 106, and enable it. Then we want to make another one, my SQL, and this is 3306 to 3306. Um, for uh, this, I'm just going to use both, not uh, TCP or UDP, but both, just in case, I don't know. And we want the same thing, so it connects to our computer, and we enable it, and we save our settings. Settings are successful, continue. And so now we're all good with that. Um, can close out our browser now. We're good with this. So now, um, if we go into our MC Law, we can start our server, and creating a listing socket on 25565 and done. Finish setting up server. Okay. So now our server is set up. And we can go on our uh, properties and set it up. So YouTube test. And we'll put some zeros before it so maybe we can find it. Um, just keep all that the same. Um, so pretty much you can just change some of these um, so here's some of the, just the basic people you can change their color, their limits uh, all the commands you have to type these in who, who can have these and who can't um, and then here's your blocks that are possible in the game um, okay, a lot of those are empty, but uh, whatever. So, uh, um, um, yeah, gosh. Okay, well. Um, that's not going to work right now, um, so I'm too lazy to go over. But so, MySQL and port forwarding are set up. So, now our server works, which is good. Um, so, now we can go into our WAM client and open up WAM. There we go. Alright, so uh, you just want to sign in. And um, you should be able to find your, uh, your server's name in here. I know there's been a lot lately. Um, I know I definitely added to this by making the model. Uh, whatever. Um, let's see. Oh, well, default. This might be ours. Okay. Uh, so we'll just do that. So I'm thinking this is our server, but so we'll find out. Mm. So if it's taken your friends a long time um, to join, like. It is right now. Just tell them to be patient. Don't really click anything. Um, that's really all I've got. Like sometimes it's just slow. Um, that's how it is. But 
Um, I don't know. Okay. Now, this isn't my server, but whatever. Um, somebody else's server, but your server will show up once you add your own name. Um, um, so, yeah, there you, uh, there you go. Um, thanks for watching, comment, like, subscribe. I'll try and get some videos up on how to set up the properties for this. So, uh, comment, like, subscribe. Thanks.